Hello, I, I'm Fran Cutchins, co-president of Pickford Chapter. And of course, it's going to be my honor and pleasure to introduce our honoree, my sister, Ruth Lebensky, who is hospitalized and she's home recovering now, I'm happy to say. But this is uh, my introduction to her. I will read it. Uh, Ruth was born in Atlantic City along with her twin brother, Sam. And don't worry, I'm not going to give you her life details. <laughs> Our family moved to the Bronx, and Ruth went to school, and more school, and she graduated, found employment, where Ruth met and fell in love with Nathan, the cop on the beach, on the street, where she worked. <laughs> They married, had a family, and moved That's me. To, uh, from the Bronx. And they moved to uh, Queens, and then, of course, to Nassau. And then there was a moment. There was a Hadassah moment. And Hadassah beckoned, and Ruth was there and became a life member on the spot. And that was 30 years ago. And Ruth had been working very hard on behalf of Hadassah, and especially with Tikva. She was ready and willing to work in both membership and program and chair and with equal aplomb. And Ruth and I shared a co-presidency for two years and we enjoyed our success in our undertakings. As the motto of the post office, neither rain nor snow nor sleet nor darkness of night has kept her from appointed rounds as she has become the champion raffle prize collector. <laughs> <laughs> Just look around. Yeah. And some of which you may be enjoying today. And Ruth is our social secretary and she has lent her calligraphic skills uh, to write special notes about the sympathy or congratulations, whatever the case may be. Ruth is a three-generation life membership family, and which include her two daughters, one of whom is here, Ginger, today, who will speak Ruth's <coughs> talk, and uh, two daughters, Ginger and uh, Barbara, and her granddaughter, Savannah, who are her treasures. We're so happy to have Ruth among us. I'm sorry she's not here today to share. She would love to be here. We'll see her when we leave. And she is devoted to Hadassah, and I am devoted to her. Thank you. That's beautiful. And then Ginger, we're going okay. to have Ruth's response. All right, so I'm going to... Yes? No, I'm going to stop, so you don't have to okay. press anything. Okay, will do. Okay. Fred. Close to your mouth. Fred. Okay. Fred. Fred. Pardon? Give her this, give her this. Oh, yes. I'm sorry. Very important, very important. <laughs> yes, we have is. a certificate which was prepared for her, for Ruth, and she'll be happy to receive it. Wow. This is beautiful. In honor of Ruth Lebensky. Beautiful. In appreciation <laughs> of your untiring efforts and dedication to Tikva chapter of Hadassah. July 12th. 2018. A very proud of that. I call her every morning on the way to work and she really doesn't tell me how much she does. I'm very proud today. All right, this is word for word my mom's speech. So I know she's prettier than me, but pretend I'm her. And this is word for word her speech. Thank you, Fran, for that beautiful introduction. Thank you for that beautiful introduction, Fran. I'm happy to be here, and to steal Fran's phrase, I'm happy to be anywhere. And today, I'm particularly happy. Um, it's been a joy to be part of the Tikva family and to witness all of the many accomplishments that I've been privileged to be a part of. As co-president, Fran and I were able to achieve our fundraising goals in dramatic fashion. Our programs were meaningful, and brought to our membership the many outstanding works of Hadassah throughout the years. When Fran and I joined Tikva 30 years ago as life members, we were able to walk two miles a day in Kaniak Park. We didn't need our walkers 
and we were able to dance up a storm. Now my back goes out more than I do. <laughs> Thank you all for being here to help me celebrate and for supporting our valuable research. And I have to say that um, while I'm an activity director at Assisted Living in Westbury, I do a lot of you know different kinds of fundraising myself, and I try to help people. And I must say that any good in my life that I do is directly related to my mother. The bad comes from somewhere else. But I thank God that my mother was my mother because all the good I do is totally because of her and Anne Fran, the great one. Thank you. Thank you very much.